recommend Senna, but it, it's still not at the mineral. It's still not at the natural because he knows that there might be uh, speedings anytime. And the toy is doing so much damage to the queen. But more importantly, his attention is is uh, is away. There are lots and lots of roaches and speedlings. These marauders are not going to do enough damage to kill to kill all these zerglings. And the roaches are going to pull it. Looking at the production tab, we do have one tank. 16 Zerglings and 4 more Roaches reinforcing. Looking at the income tab, it is even, so they are going to make, but looking at the production facilities, there are only 4 barracks and a factory, 4 jigs, and I'm not sure if he's going to be able to make enough units to defend this in time. And it looks like he is actually going to be able to hold. But look at that, that's, that's wave 2. Sweet right now is just, he knows he has the advantage, he has 2 base, the turret is on 1 base, he... You know, but look, he is 22 workers over 30, so he knows he has to push in, otherwise he is going to fall behind. These roaches are going to take out this tank so easy, and looking at the army, it is a 300 army versus 1,400. 42 foot over 67, and all these SCVs are going to go down. I think this is GG for Jix. This is going to be GG, because he, he's just using his SCVs to just hold off the line, but... I mean, this is a great play by Sweet again. He just... He just stuck to links and roaches for, for winning the game, but credit to him because he made the right unit composition and he was able to bust down. He the, had the, enough the links door. to tank for the Marauders, yes, so the Marauders were not hitting uh, roaches. And, and, and the most important thing was he forced Jigs into being very defensive with the early bane links because only by then Jigs was only concentrating on getting you know his, his pack, his structures, but. In the meantime, he was not producing enough units to handle the, the roaches and the speedlings. So, these roaches are just going to take out the marauders so easily. Although, marauders are especially good against roaches, but we're just going to see a GG anytime soon. Yeah, Jix is completely mined out. He does not have the income to support it. He does have a lot of production facilities, but he's not going to be able to make out of it because he is so, so very poor. And, you know, he does not even have any gas. So, he's only surviving off fuel income and... After a while, this Zerg constant, constant Zerg pressure is going to power him down. And there goes the GG. But what a game, what a game. I, I have to say, just remember the, 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 the mind games and the high level play that goes on. Jix was like, okay, I'm going, I'm going to bunker up, I'm going to play defensive, but I'm still going to harass. I harass with 3 Marines and a, and a Hellion. I'm going to harass with Dropship, Double Hellion, Dropship 4. And if you actually look at one point, even though... He basically, Sweet had two base, he was always lower harvesters than Sweet. But Sweet is like, okay, screw it, I'm not going to let you break my tempo, I'm going to attack on time. I'm going to attack, <laughs> since you're microing so hard, you can't really have that much units, because you most likely are going to go for the fast expansion, because of the harass. And just basically make a whole bunch of units and push down the front door. But I what, think what, 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 um... Jigs lacked in that game was actually more Hellions because he saw there was, oh, so many so there were so many speedlings and he he is still stuck to getting getting Thor's getting Marines but what I think he really needed was a lot of Hellions because remember he has that pre ignited upgrade and that if if you have five Hellions on the field with Marauders or 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 tanks and uh or tanks and um Thor's backing them up I I think they're just gonna like rape those Zerglings alive. <laughs> Is Rafe allowed in the cast? Uh, uh, yeah, but, sure but anyways, this is HG and HD Phoenix signing out. Do stick around. We do have a post-game interview with Jix and Sweet. And just listen to them. Uh, what, 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 they are, what are their thoughts on the game rather than just listening to two of us. Alright, so see you in the post-game interview. See you guys. Hey, this is HD Phoenix. I'm standing with Jix and Sweet. What a nail-biting game. Jix, what do you think that... Uh, what do you think you could have done against that? That was just like a lot of zerglings and roaches. Well, I... I really wasn't expecting that in the first place. I was I was uh, preparing for middle east since since uh, the the first second I entered the game, and then and I didn't see him go player at all. And then I see spellingness, I see roachness. So I was like, what the hell? Who the hell on earth plays up like this? So I was trying my best to defend it. I defended it a couple of waves until uh, he still managed to break through it, and I just don't have enough unit to defend it. Sweet, um, you went actually quite unconventional because most people would go Zergling Roach and then transit into high attack units but you just stick with the, the meat and the bone of the Zerg army, Zerglings and Roaches and you just Zerg them to death basically. What, what, what was going through your mind when you were playing that? Because it's just terror, I, I don't like to go uh, to late game because it's very hard to micro the Daddies, the Mutabis, the Avengers. So I try my very best to finish terror in the few minutes of the game. Uh, in the mid game, so I will 
because Daryl has a better the breakthrough that means uh, more easy than Zerg. So Zerg has a uh, needs to micro very well to use Daryl in the So I want a good game for which. So I, I play Roaches and Zerg. Very aggressively. Yeah, well, that was the first, that was an amazing first game. I can't wait to see the second game. Thanks, guys, and I'll see you in game two.